Now, we continue question 5 here. Let's see now. What do they say? They say that you, they want angle P, R, T. Well, we find that P, R, or P, R, T. Oh, you must find P, R, T. All of this angle they want. Let me make sure I don't move up my information. All of this angle they want. My, my. Let's see now. If you consider PRT as one whole triangle, right? One big triangle. You notice you have this angle already, 76. Let's see if I can get this angle. Hmm. I have 28 here. Oh, guess what? You see from here all the way to here, this entire angle is 180 is on a straight line. So if I have 180 and take 28 away, I have what is left. So 180 minus 28. Do that with a calculator and let me see what you get. So it's 180. Right, 180, and you minus, you take 28 away from that, you get 152. So you basically have an angle of 152 here. Good. Guess what? QP and QR are the same size. So therefore, this angle... QPR and the angle QRT must be the same. So, guess what now? This angle here and this angle here must be the same. And all of them add up to 180. Let me call, for now, let me call this X and this X because I don't know them. So, what I know is that X plus X plus 152 equal 180. So, x plus x is 180 minus 152. Right? So, I have the 180 minus, 100 minus 152. And you're left with, oh, guess what? We know the answer already, you know. Because earlier, we actually did it. So, 180 minus 152 leave you with this same exact 28 here. So, that equals 28. X plus X is 28. That means 2X is 28. So, X is 28 over 2. 28 divided by 2 is 14. So, guess what? This angle is 14. So, we have 14 as this angle. You see that? What they want again? PRT. They want all of PRT. All of this. But guess what? You have 14 here. 14 right along here. But the rest of it is 76. So all you have to do is add them. So 76 plus 14 gives you 6 and 4, 10, 7, 1, 8 and 1, 9. 90 degrees. So this is a 90 degree angle. In other words, a right angle. So we have this as 90. Now, what they say here now is SPT. SPT. They want SPT. Hmm. I know part of SPT already, you know. It's 14 degrees. But they want all of it. SPT, given that, given that what? SRT equal 145. SRT is 145. All right. We take care of business with this so far. If SRT is 145, and I want SRP, this angle, 
I know that all of this is 76 plus 14, which is 90. This is 90. From here to here is 90. Right here is 90, right? This is 90. The rest add up to 145. 145 minus 90, in other words, 90 plus what give you 145? 90 and 10 give you 100 and then 45 more gives you 145. So the 10 to reach 100, then the 45 more give you a total of 55. You can also do it with a calculator. Um, you could say 145 minus 90. You get 55 degrees. So I take care of business with this so far. And then the other angle they give, PSR. Where is that? Where is that? PSR. This angle PSR, what they say about it? It is 100. So this is 100. Hmm. So, what they say they want again? SPT. They want SPT. I have part of this as 14 already. And then I need this part. Guess what? S R P is a triangle. One angle is 100. The other angle is 55. So far, you know that you use up 155 degrees. And the rest of it must add up to 180. So, the total angle is 180 and I have 155 out of that already. So, what remains is this. So now, I just do the algebra type, the algorithm. 5 minus 0 can. 1 from 8 leaves 7. I have 10, 10 minus 5 is 5. 7 minus 5 is 2. Guess what? This is 25, you know. And that 25 plus the 14 that we know about here is 25 plus 14. 4 and 5, 9, 2 and 1, 3. That gives you 39. So all of this, the angle here is 39 degrees. What did I write? 39 degrees. So that is 39 degrees. Alright, so thank you very much. See you later.